Hello Brass Monkey fans, I'm Kevin Ripa and this is My Sands 3 Minutes Max. As many of you uh, probably know, and maybe some of you have even taken it, uh, I'm the co-author along with Eric Zimmerman for a Sands class called uh, Forensics 498 Battlefield Forensics and Data Acquisition. Now this class is kind of it's a six-day class, and it kind of is a, is a split. Uh, half of the class is acquisition uh, only, and half of the class is quick wins or battlefield uh, triage or forensics, however you want to call it. And uh, as we've been giving this, this class over uh, the last couple of years, uh, one thing has become quite evident, uh, and that is that there is a need for uh, acquisition training. There's no other SANS class that actually teaches acquisition in the forensics curriculum. Uh, there's many great, fantastic forensics classes, but they're all uh, pretty much analysis. Well, what we've done in the last uh, couple of months is we've created uh, a new class, and it's called uh, Forensics 498A, A being for acquisition. And we've created a three-day class that's kind of a... a, a a spin-off of the, of the longer six-day class, and it is just acquisition for three solid days, nothing more. We don't do any analysis. We just acquire, acquire, acquire. And it is acquisition of just about anything. Uh, we're doing acquisition of RAM, Mac and Windows. We do acquisition of iPhone and Android. We're doing acquisition of cloud storage, AWS, for example. Uh, online repositories such as Gmail or Google accounts and uh, going into how to pull data off of the wire, how to acquire data uh, off of the network, off of the wire, how to acquire data, uh, how to acquire virtual machines and uh, ESXi setups and where, where you have servers that are a whole host of virtual machines along with collecting their RAM. We even talk about uh, collecting data, doing acquisitions of Internet of Things devices in as much as you possibly can. So if this is something that interests you, uh, keep an ear to the ground. You're going to see uh, more publicity about it in the, in the coming month or so. And uh, as a matter of fact, I believe later today there's going to be some, uh, some promotional material being created uh, to, to coincide with that release. But in the meantime, and in between time, that's it. Another episode of 3 Minutes Max.